What's up everybody, this is Electric Yoshi HD, and welcome back to yet another Pokemon card unboxing video. And today we have a Mega Sharpedo EX Premium Collection box to open up. So I purchased this online for about 40 Australian dollars, and also today I picked up a Charizard GX Hidden Fates tin, so that'll be a separate opening in a different video, I'll upload hopefully soon as well. But for now, we are going to up, uh, open this Mega Shell Peter EX Premium Collection box, and let's go ahead and set the camera down and open this thing up. So here it is, guys, out of the box, and now we're just going to sort of separate one side of the plastic from the other, and we can see the Mega Shell Peter. Let's get it out. Oops, that was loud. Okay, got that, got that, set that aside. Let's take a look at the cards. They're slightly bent from the packaging. So I've got Sharpedo and Mega Sharpedo EX. So let's actually angle the camera a little more upward so you can see. There we go. Sharpedo EX, directly from the uh, Primal Clash set, I believe. Is it Primal Clash? Yeah, I think. And then Mega Sharpedo EX is a Black Star promo. Um, that looks really nice as well. So let's set those aside. And take a look at the rest of the box. So we have the, whoops, the pin. That's over here. If it wants to focus, hold on. There it is, that's the pin. Mega Sharpedo. And the coin, where'd the coin go? Oh, here's the coin. It fell on the floor. Let's just get it out. And that is the Mega Sharpedo coin as well. Oops, it's the wrong way. There it is. Sorry about my voice, guys. I'm a bit sick. <clears throat> so I have to clear it a bit there. And then let's get all the packs out as well. We have a lot of packs to open today, which is nice. Hopefully to make up for those terrible openings we had recently. So one side got the code card, one side the Sharpie, the Spirit Link, and the Jumbo card, of course. Can't forget that. So here's a review of the Sharpie, the Spirit Link card. There's that. And the code card for the box. I'm not sure what this gives you, but there you go, guys. That's the code. That side. And here's a look at the Jumbo card. Doesn't fit on the camera at all, but that's a Mega Sharp Eater EX Jumbo card. If I kind of angle it like that, you kind of see it, but yeah. Okay, so packs for today. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six packs to open. And looks like. We've got two Steam Siege, one Fates Collide, two Sun and Moon, and an Evolutions. Nice. My luck with Evolutions is crazy. It's just crazy good. So hopefully we get some good pulls in this video. I think we're going to do a Steam, Steam Siege sandwich. Yep. So let's keep those there and get on to opening these. So Steam Siege. I've also had very good luck with uh, the Steam Siege set as well. I pulled a Gardevoir EX Secret Rare on YouTube once. If you go back and have a look at some of my older videos, you'll find some very good pulls from the XY series. So, green code card. That's the code. I'll make sure to give away the codes as well, because I think I was forgetting to do that last time. Free from the back, I'm pretty sure. Hopefully I didn't mess that up. But anyways, we have a Chimchar. A Meowth. A Hoppit. Litwick, Mareep, Braviary, Armor Fossil Shieldon, Nuzleaf, Reverse Hollow of a Mankey, just the common, and a Galvantula Dual Type, so Electric and Grass Type. That's the rare, non hollow. On to the next pack, we've got Sun and Moon, the set in which GXs were first introduced. When they make the Sword and Shield um, cards, I wonder if they'll still be GX, or they'll make a new one, like a ZX or something. That'll be funny. But kind of cool too, you know? Decidueye pack art on the front. I love Decidueye. Very cool Pokemon. That's the code. Uh, Sun and Moon should be four from the back, is it? I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure it's four from the back. Okay, so we have a Moralol. A Fermentus, Surskit, Growlithe, not holding it very straight, am I? Uh, Crabroll, 
Fighting type energy. Uh, Howl Trainer. Pinsert. Rare Candy. Reverse Holo of a Brion. That's just a common. And we have a Primarina GX. Nice pull right there. So, the final evolution of Poplio, I believe. Yes, it is. And that's the look of the Primarina GX. So, we'll set that at the back. Hopefully, it doesn't fall behind. There's a little gap there. And if you're wondering what those things are, it's just my coins and those my pins. I just leave them there. On to evolutions. Um, what am I hoping for an evolution set? Oh, I'm not even sure, guys. I have so many cards from evolutions. So many ultra rares. So let's just open this up and see what we get. So, code card. Now, evolutions is XY series set, so I believe it's three from the back, is it? I don't know. Let's just go with that. Okay, so we have a Caterpie. Drowsy. Magikarp. Electabuzz. Rattata. Haunter. Brock's Grit Trainer. A Slowbro Spirit Link. Ooh, and a Machamp Break. That's nice. And also an Arcanine non Hollow Rare. So we got a Machamp break out of that. That's pretty cool. Don't actually have this card. I have a couple of breaks. But that's a new one. So let's just... If that wants to stay, yep. What was that? That was an Evolution set, I believe. Yeah. So next up, yet another Sun and Moon pack. So that's the code card. There's a code for you guys. Now Sun and Moon is four from the back. Could feel the texture on that last card. Hopefully it's a ultra rare. Oops, something fell. Okay. Poliwag. Sandy Gast. Eevee. Crab Roller. Marini. Grass type. Uh, grass type energy card. Sorry. Professor Kukui Trainer. Golbat. Repel. Reverse Hollow Poliwhirl. And a Masquerain Non Hollow Rare. So, just go ahead and put these cards aside because they keep falling. Next up, we've got Fates Collide, a series that I've had terrible luck with. Never usually get anything from these packs, but that's fine. Hopefully, you can get something. What have I done with this pack? Jesus. Okay. That, that's the code. And Fates Collide is three from the back, I hope. I believe. I'm uh, pretty sure you can get break cards from this set, so... Yeah. Got a Gathita. Oops, just gotta straighten that up. A Meowth. Snivy. You can see the texture hit. I'm not holding these. Damn, I think we got a break, guys. Solosis. Fennekin. Ultra Ball. Oh my god. Jeez, <laughs> we got a break. Kabuto. Kangaskhan. And we got a Lugia break. And a Kabutops, Kabutops non holo, and there's the break card, guys. I held that pack terribly, you could see it the whole time, but another break, nice. Another one I don't have as well. Whoops, that fell. Damn it. Yes, I gotta work on holding those packs. So we've got three good cards so far, and no hollows or anything, no reverse holo rares, I believe, and onto a Steam Siege pack now. Because I can do it the old way, how I old packs, but then I just sort of wrap my entire hand around it. And my hands are massive, they're really big, so it's just kind of annoying. It's just like a big hand, a big fat hand behind it. Um, anyway, there's the code. Steam Siege, three from the back. Okay. I think I'm just going to hold it like this, the way I always used to do it, but whatever. So we've got Clink. Mantine, Shellos, Marill, whoops, Drifloon, Halucha, Tangrowth, Special Charge Trainer item, uh, Reverse Holo Hopip, and a Yveltal Holo. Is that a Holo? Yes, I believe I have this card already, but that's still pretty cool. So that's the opening done, guys. Uh, let's summarize the pools right now. I thought it was uh, decent pulls, I guess. We got two breaks, a GX, and a Hollow. So, we've got Lugia break, 
Machamp Break, Primarina GX, and a Eveltal Hollow, and I can also uh, show you guys the two Sharpedo cards we got as well from the box itself. So, Sharpedo EX from Primal Clash, and Mega Sharpedo EX Black Star Promo. So, nice six cards there to add to my collection. And yeah, that's the opening finished. So, thanks for watching this Mega Sharpedo EX collection box, guys. And we'll see you very soon when I open the Hidden Fates Charizard GX tin. So, thanks for watching. See ya.